Okay, this is lesson 43, number 22. One third of the way from two and two thirds to six and one third. So let's just say two times three is six, that's eight thirds, or two and two thirds. If this is zero, this is, I don't know, it's somewhere right here, right? It's two times three, it's eight thirds. And then, I kind of wish I didn't do all this detail here. One, two, three, five, six, seven. So this thing would be um, six times three is 18, 19 thirds. Something like that. And so there's a little formula for this. Some of you guys might have already caught on to it. But um, basically, if I want to go one third of the way from this one to this one, it's going to be somewhere in here, right? I mean, it'll be somewhere in between them. So the way you can get that is you can go the initial thing, which is 8 thirds, plus 1 third of whatever this distance is. And I can get this distance by going 19 thirds. Hey, isn't that nice? They gave us a common denominator. Minus 8 thirds. Does that make sense? This one's yours, um, Cameron. This is your number 22. Okay. So, um, so sometimes they say what they say. This is initial. This is fraction, and this is final minus initial. Oh, the F is bad because it's final. I don't know. That's kind of. That's kind of that stands for initial. There's a little formula for it, but I, if you forget the formula, you can just draw it and look at it and think of common sense. Think of like you're going to find one third of the distance, so that means you have to subtract and then multiply it by a third or divide by three and then add that to where you started from. So 19 minus 8 is, is that 11 thirds times one third, so plus 8 thirds. So, oh, it messes up my denominator, huh? That's 11 ninths. So if I write this as ninths, then I can go 24 ninths. Okay. So and then 24 plus 11 could be 35 ninths. Did I do it right? Did you guys all get this? I got that too. I thought it was wrong at first because I thought it should be like 36. <laughs> it goes in. Oh. Uh, <laughs> 35. Yeah. Is that okay? Can, do you have questions on that one, Cameron? Okay, that one's on YouTube in case you need to see it again sometime. Let me push the button.